level 30 Slayer coming in. We can uh, do Pyre Fiends, which is, they're pretty good for level 2 Flu Scrolls, so who knows, maybe Ranger Boots incoming? Huh? Maybe? Oh yeah. 45 frames. This task is absolutely amazing. I have like, I think I started with 54 and the, the XP is just great. I, I honestly, I love this task. It's awesome. Alright guys, we just got our 10th task in. It's 97 cockatrice. It's going to be great because it's going to be a lot of medium clue scrolls as well as limper roots. It's going to be fantastic. First time getting the task and let's see how much XP we get. Alright guys, we just got ourselves our first pair of mystic boots light. Oh yeah, that's going to be nice in the Slayer collection. Not going to out that because I can actually use it for now until I get Affinity Boots, but that's going to be a long, a long, long time away. So, yeah. Alright guys, we finished our 10th task in a row. That's actually a pretty good achievement because it gave me 20 points and that's great because I actually need to learn how to make broad bolts. But that's not going to be for the distant future. Anyways. Let's go ahead and get a new task. Hopefully it's Green Dragons or, you know, 89 Rock Slugs because that's exactly what I wanted. Alrighty, so we're coming in for a new task and we actually got really lucky and we got two pairs of Mystic Gloves Light, which is a one, one out of 512 drop rate. So technically that could have been two whips, you know, if I was killing Abbey Demons. But let's go ahead and get a task. 70 Hobgoblins, that is great. I'm probably going to do them at Falador. Maybe about the crafting guild because there's a lot there. So let's go ahead and get started with that and collect the limper roots. Our, all right, guys, here we go. Our first medium blue scroll, and it's a load of junk. I mean, that would have been nice earlier, and yeah, probably should have did it earlier. But two animate hatchets, you know, not bad at all, I guess, for the first clue. Thirty-five Slayer, high out of the way. That's awesome. We can now kill a wall piece. Alright guys, this is like the best moment that I've had training Slayer, 53 green dragons. I actually need dragon bones so I can get 43 prayer. And I need around 112, so this is just under half of what I need, which is great. The only bad thing is, it's 4 o'clock on a holiday weekend, and yeah, I'm going to get PK'd a lot. So I want to make sure not to take anything that I don't want to lose. So yeah, let's go get ourselves some dragon bones. Yeah, 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 I know I keep missing all the levels, but we just got Slayer level 40, which is great because now we can kill Basilisk, and they're really good for nature runes, and rune medium helms, I believe. So this is where I was, I'm going to start making money, and out of three tasks, I've had four of these gloves, and they're one out of 512 drop rate. so hopefully I can keep this up with the whips uh, in the long, long, long distant future. But, uh, yeah. More Mystic Gloves. And here we go. About to hit 55 range. I actually caught a level, but now we can wield Red Chin Chumpas, which I probably won't be chinning on this account, realistically. I'll just be uh, training it through Slayer. And 99 range most likely will be my first 99, just because, you know, I save on food. I can save spot a lot of monsters. You know, it's no big deal. Okay guys, so I actually have a huge debate that I should do right now. I got a new task, and the task is 98 crocodiles, and I absolutely hate crocodiles, uh, just for the fact that they keep running away and whatnot. So I have 80 Slayer points, but I'm not sure if I should go ahead and skip it or save it for the uh, broad bolt fletching, because those are really, really handy, you know. But I think I'm going to take the chance and go ahead and cancel the task. Hopefully it'll be a good one. Uh, let's see what we get. Oh, alright, well, totally worth it. Sweet! Alright, this right here is exactly why I love the Iron Man. Just because you have to safe spot everything. You know, you can't just go and buy prayer potions and just pray flick everything and whatnot. This right here is... I mean, look at my gear. Blue skirt, wizard hat, and mystic boots and gloves, and then a enchanted top which I got very lucky on it's just oh man just the thrill I love the low level gameplay on an Iron Man it's so fun and that's one reason why I stopped playing my other Iron Man and sorry I'm just fishing on my other account right now is because I don't know I got to a higher level and it was harder and harder to make episodes because it would take like 200 hours for me to get a 10, 10 minute video out you know so and with me working a full-time job and just brand new married and, you know, it's just, I don't have time for it anymore. Uh, just a point where you have to set your priorities and whatnot, so. 
Yeah, that, that's one reason why I stopped doing my unofficial Iron Man series, just because I really didn't have time for it anymore. But at a lower level, you know, I can produce decent videos and get them out there fast for you guys. Man, how can I miss a level of doing this? Like, I'm AFKing. It's because the drop showed up and I missed it. But we just got level 50 magic as well as 53 hit points, and we are now 57 combat. So that is pretty sweet. Only, uh... Two more levels until we can do high alchemy using the wizard mind bomb boost. So yeah, good things, good things. Level 10 fire making incoming. I'm getting level 50 so I can do the new, uh, the new mini boss or whatever the hell it's called. So yeah, hopefully we can get some good loot from it. Just got level 50 wood cutting on our way towards 50 wood, or fire making, my bad. And, uh, yeah, level 30 right now. I need 1,000 willow logs. I'm at about 500 right now, so halfway there. Level 40 fire making incoming. Only 10 more to go, which is pretty cool. I've been doing that on my main account, and it seems like really good XP. I'm getting around 230k XP an hour at level 70, so that's pretty awesome. Anyways, uh, hopefully I can do this, because I noticed on my main account it's 99 HP. But I get hit a lot on that account. I use about, like... Three to two, two to three brews a game, which I don't have on this account, obviously. So who knows? It it might work. It might not work. We'll find out. And there we go. Fifty fire making out of the way, which means we can actually go and do the winter t toad tote, what whatever it's called. I don't know. But that new boss that came out. So yeah, let's go and uh, try it out. I might have to do. A quest, I believe, the Herbler one, but that shouldn't be too big of a deal. I'm gonna go ahead and buy a house while I'm here so I can get construction XP and have a good time. Alright, so this is the end of my first game. It, uh, I sort of got if I die right now, I'm gonna be really upset. But first game, getting 1100 points, that's really good, I think, at least. So, yeah, let's see what our first reward is. I had to use, like, 12 lobsters, I do believe. But we get burnt pages, some dynamite, and some coins. Coins are my best friend right now. That's that's really good. Kill kill number two, and we get 8k coins with a lot of gold ore. Amazing loot, guys. Amazing. This is a really good boss. Oh! Did you see how much I died with? I am so upset right now. One point, like 2k points, and I die. Ah... Okay, so I just finished my sixth boss, and we got three Uranar Seeds. That is just so good, and 30 U Logs. That, dude, this boss is just amazing for my account right now, so... Yeah, I'm gonna keep doing this for probably a very, very, very long time. So, yeah. Alright, here we go. We should be getting level 60 fire making any second now, as well as the loot crate. There we go, 60 fire making. This is actually so good. So good, guys. And we get the... Oh my god, we got the garb. That is sweet. And gold ore and snapdragon seeds. This is why this boss is just absolutely amazing. It's, it's just out of the question how good it is. It, it's great. Oh my god. I'm sorry guys for spamming you with this. But I didn't even realize that it dropped pure essence. I completely forgot about it. Two Ragnar seeds and 300 pure essence. Wow, this is, this is kind of OP, honestly. But hey, you know what? I'm not complaining. Alright, here we go guys. About to break a milestone. 100k cash. That is awesome. Next goal that we're aiming for is 500k. That's going to be nice to see in the bank. But of course I'm going to spin all this here in a minute because i got to get myself a rune plate body after I finish Dragon Slayer. And of course I need a helm of need not. So, yeah, I'm going to be broke again. And we just got the hood. Awesome. Awesome. Means I can stay warmer, which means less damage. Thank God. Guys, look at what we just got. Chest 81. We get the Bruma Torch. Dude, that is so rare nowadays. I, like, I, I don't know what it's for. I think it's just the light source. But that's so cool. That is... That's different. That is for sure. I, honestly, I kind of wanted the... Uh, the Tome of Fire before that. But, you know, whatever. That's awesome. The Torch is a great reward. Oh my god, just because of how rare it is. I don't even know what it does, honestly. I'm going to have to look it up. Just got 60 wood cutting. I actually didn't miss the little pop-up, but I got damaged, so it disappeared. But there we go, 60 out of the way. Okay, so I just got another torch. That's pretty damn rare. 
Alright, so I'm taking a little break from the winter toe, and I'm going back to Hunter for a little bit, and we are almost level 70 Hunter. I'll go ahead and get it real quick. There we go, level 70 Hunter. Nothing unlocked, but at 74 we can do uh, uh, Ninja Amplings, and then we can get a lot of cool stuff from them. So let's go ahead and go till 74, and then we'll take a break from this and go to Peru Peru. Look you there boys, 74 Hunter out of the way, that's awesome, Wait, let's go to Peru Peru. Okay, so after many, many attempts of trying to get a fucking ninja, people kept stealing it, I saw like five, and people stole like every single one, it, it was nuts. But we finally get one, so let's go ahead and loot our first one, and it's 40 throwing knives, not the best, but do they alk for anything good? Uh, 100 GP, so no, so I'll just leave them in the bank for now, but I'm gonna... Oh my god, just loot it. There we go. Yeah, nothing too good. Okay, great news guys. I just got blue dehyde chaps from a random electric ampling and that's so good. So I can upgrade for my green dehyde legs and oh man, that's that's wonderful. I love this place. 45 Slayer incoming. We actually didn't get to see what, what it unlocked, uh, if anything. Infernal mages. Ooh, you can keep those. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. So, as you guys can see, I'm actually training prayer right now. I got a new slayer task and it's 60 green dragons. So I'm like, oh, alright, well I'll go ahead and go. And then like, there was like 20 PKers there and all attacking me with uh, flames and zami and stuff. So I'm deciding to go ahead and get protect from magic. I have enough bones for that, which is good. And this task will actually give me enough bones for 43 prayer. I think I'll have to kill like two extra off tasks, but that's no big deal, you know. But let's go ahead and get this uh, 37 prayer out of the way. Well, after about, oh, I don't know, 20 PK attempts, we finally finished our task and got all our bones for 43 prayer, which is what I'm about to get right now. And I have my sounds on, so I do apologize. But 43 prayer, there we go. Let's try this bad boy out. Oh, yeah. You guys are going to be seeing a lot of that prayer flicking here in the future. And we just missed another level. 45 attack. They, they just sneak up on me, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, guys. Going to go ahead and end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, appreciate it. You can go to episode one in the description below. And then the next episode should be out shortly.